What's up, YouTube? It's Big Lou tapping on back in on this uh, nice breezy Tuesday morning in the west side of California, northern California, that is. But anyway, <clears throat> I want to tap back in and uh, do my second half of my uh, top ten. I did a video of my top five Latino players of all time in the NBA with rings, and I did top five favorite players, period, just in general. But I went ahead and made a second list, so six through ten now. But what I uh, I made a mistake that day, and that was I should have had Al Horford, uh, <clears throat> Al Horford and Gilbert Arenas should have been on my uh, within the first five. So they should have been probably like number Al Horford probably number two, and then Arenas probably number three or number five. And um, so we're gonna go ahead and Al Horford. He's been in the league for 15 years, still counting right now. 15 years, right? He's a six foot nine, six foot ten, depending what list you see. Uh, power forward slash center. He plays both positions. Um, he was drafted from the University of Florida, and uh, at the championship. I believe they were a championship team with uh, with Noah. And uh, he was drafted first round, third pick overall, 2007, from uh, by the my uh, Atlanta uh, uh, Hawks. Excuse me, dang. And uh, he's a five-time All-Star. He's a one-time All-NBA second team. And he's a one-time All-NBA defensive second team. His career numbers are 13.7 points a game, 8.2 rebounds a game, 3.2 assists a game. And his career shooting percentage is 53.6% from the field. That's pretty dang good. 15 seasons, and he's still, and that's his, that's his average. Okay, Gilbert Arenas, like I mentioned, he played only 11 seasons in the NBA. Uh, this dude had a hell of a career, and he and, and he still was playing good when he, whatever reasons, I mean, you know, he got in a little trouble bringing the guns and all that. The NBA don't play that shit, you know. So, obviously, that had a lot to do with it. And he's six foot four. He came out of the University of Arizona. He played with uh, Richard Jefferson. And he was drafted in the second round, 31st pick, in 20, uh, 2001, right? He's a three-time All-Star. He's a uh, one-time All-NBA second team. And a two-time All NBA third team, and his averages are um, 20.7 points a game, 3.9 rebounds a game, and 5.3 assists a game. Uh, and he also was the NBA Most Improved for the year 2000. And then remember Big Nene? He used to go by uh, Hilario Nene or Nene Hilario, out of Brazil. Big body, 6'10 dude, could bang down low rebounds you know what i mean he was picked uh first round seventh pick in the 2002 draft his uh career numbers are 11 points a game 11.3 points a game and six rebounds a game he played 18 seasons in the nba and my next two are the twin brothers the lopez brothers they're from my, not far from where i'm from they went to the university of stanford they both got drafted in the 2008 draft brook came was the brook was the 10th pick overall and he's a one-time champion. He's an All-NBA defensive team, second team, and he's a one-time All-Star. His career numbers are 16 points a game, 16.4 points a game, 6.2 rebounds a game, and 1.8 blocks a game. All right, and his brother Robin was drafted the same round, first round, 15th pick. And he's got, they both got 14 years in the NBA. His career numbers are a little bit lower because uh, uh, Brooks are more of an offensive uh, piece. Uh, 8.7 points a game, five rebounds a game, and 1.1 blocks a game. So those are my next five. I'm all Latin, Latin favorite top ten players of all time. And um, with that being said, Big Lou tapping on out. With what it do with Big Lou?